Have you ever wondered how real estate agents get so many reviews on websites like Zillow or Yelp or Google? Hi, I'm Calvin Curry, and in this video, I'm gonna talk about how you can get more real estate reviews for your business. So Google, I think it was Google, somebody released a uh, stat recently that reviews are almost as powerful as referrals, and people look at reviews as much as they are looking for a referral. So if you got really good reviews online, that's as powerful as somebody recommending you. And there's a few things that you can do to bump the amount of reviews that you get online. The first thing is after you interact, once you close a home, whether you're working with a buyer or a seller, go and ask them what they thought of your services. And, and the sooner you do this after you close, especially if, the, if they're excited, the better. And they're gonna be more just raving about you if they had a really good experience right after the sale versus if you follow up three, four, five, six weeks later. So be quick about it. The first thing you wanna do, at least in my opinion, this is what I would do, is follow up and make sure they're happy. So you could ask them something like this. Hey, Mr. Seller, thank you so much for using me to sell your home. Hey, listen, I get a lot of my business from reviews and referrals and I just wanted to check with you and make sure that I did a good job. So I have two questions. Number one, what did I do really well that I should continue to do and that you liked? And number two, what could I have done better? That way if they are bothered, they don't feel like they don't have to lie to you or they're not going to be dishonest with you and you can use that to learn but you can also use that to overcome any concerns before you ask for a review so if somebody's bothered at you you obviously don't or do, isn't happy with your services you don't really want to ask for a review if they're going to leave something negative because you want positive reviews and also it gives you an opportunity to fix something that may have made them unhappy so that's why i recommend first leading with hey what did i do well that I can do better or that I should continue doing and what could I have done better and so you're not going to don't word it negatively just view word it in a positive way what could have I done better and so after you get that as long as they are happy with you the next thing to do is ask for a review so after they say you know if they have something negative correct it make sure they're happy and once they're enthusiastic on all levels then ask for a review and ask for a review on a specific site or page. So if you're getting a lot of reviews on Zillow, focus there and ask for their review on, on Zillow. If you have a lot of good reviews on Yelp and you're getting a lot of businesses from it, ask for a review on Yelp or Google or whatever the platform is. Obviously where the most business is going to come from or the most people are looking at and it has the most authority, go there. And if you can get them to give you reviews on multiple platforms, get it. The more, the better. So let's, let's recap. Follow up, make sure they're happy, Ask, ask them what you could have done better. Once they're enthusiastic, then ask for the review. Once you get the review, kind of a bonus tip is then ask for referral because it's that law of commitment and consistency. Once somebody makes a commitment, they want to stay consistent with the commitments they made. So if they give you a good review, a referral is a really second, a really good next question. You could ask for both at the same time or you could start with the review, get that first, and then go for the referral. So if you liked this video, hit the like button, subscribe below, and if you have anything to add to the conversation, tips, tricks, or strategies that you've used, post them in the comments below. Let's continue the conversation there and talk more about it. So thanks for watching, and we'll talk to you next time.